The Pearl Roundabout is not only the center of Bahrain's democracy movement, it also has every amenity you can imagine, including a barber. So since it's uh, since there's no violence so far today, I thought I'd take a break and get a trim myself. I feel better already, and a little off the top, never hurt anybody. That would be true of the Bahraini power structure as well. I am here for his future. He's our future. And do you think that he will grow up in a democratic Bahrain? This is what we are working to. We will guarantee that he will grow up in a democracy. There's been a Western concern that a more democratic Bahrain will also be a anti-Western Bahrain or will be uh, hostile to women's rights. Based on the evidence right here in the roundabout, that doesn't seem very likely. Frankly, Western reporters, at least, are just embraced and welcomed because people are so hostile to Bahrain news organizations and they see us, in a sense, as a safeguard, as a, as a mechanism to keep the troops from attacking them. As for women, well, women have been central to this democracy movement from the very beginning. They've been marching in large numbers. And frankly, there have been more women in the protest movement than there have been in the government trying to crush them.